UFC 301 Promotional Guidelines Compliance Pay Jose Aldo Nets $21,000 for Potential Final UFC Fight The world of mixed martial arts, MMA, is often characterized by its electrifying fights, larger-than-life personalities, and the glitz and glamour of promotions like the Ultimate Fighting Championship, UFC. In this realm, UFC 301 stands as a significant event, showcasing top-tier talent and captivating audiences worldwide. However, beyond the spotlight of the octagon lies a crucial aspect of UFC fights, the Promotional Guidelines Compliance Pay PGC Pay. In this article, we delve into the story behind UFC 301 and explore how one of the sport's legends, Jose Aldo, earned $21,000 in PGC pay for what could potentially be his final UFC bout. Jose Aldo, a UFC legend. Before delving into the specifics of UFC 301, it's essential to understand the significance of Jose Aldo in the realm of MMA. Hailing from Brazil, Aldo rose to prominence as one of the most dominant champions in UFC history. With a background in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu and striking, Aldo's explosive style captivated fans and solidified his status as a UFC legend. Throughout his illustrious career, Aldo achieved numerous accolades, including a lengthy reign as the UFC featherweight champion. His fights against the likes of Chad Mendes, Frankie Edgar, and Conor McGregor are etched in MMA history, showcasing his unparalleled skill and resilience inside the octagon. Understanding Promotional Guidelines Compliance Pay In the world of UFC, fighters not only compete for glory but also for financial compensation. One aspect of this compensation is the Promotional Guidelines Compliance Pay, which is a component of the UFC Athlete Outfitting Policy. This policy dictates that fighters must adhere to specific uniform guidelines and, in return, receive compensation from the UFC's official outfitting partner. Factors such as a fighter's tenure with the UFC and their placement in the official UFC rankings influence the amount of PGC pay they receive for each fight. This additional source of income supplements fighters' earnings from fight purses and performance bonuses. UFC 301 – Jose Aldo's Last Stand As UFC 301 approached, the spotlight shone brightly on Jose Aldo, with speculation swirling about whether this could potentially be his final fight in the UFC. With a legendary career behind him, Aldo's bout at UFC 301 carried immense significance, both for him personally and for MMA fans worldwide. In the context of his potential farewell fight, Aldo's PGC pay at UFC 301 takes on added importance. For a fighter of Aldo's stature, each dollar earned in PGC pay serves as a testament to his contributions to the sport and his enduring legacy in the UFC. Breaking down Jose Aldo's $21,000 PGC pay, in the aftermath of UFC 301, it was revealed that Jose Aldo earned $21,000 in PGC pay for his performance in what could potentially be his final UFC fight. While this amount may seem modest compared to the purses of top-tier fighters, it carries significant weight in the context of Aldo's career and the PGC pay structure. Comparisons with Aldo's previous PGC pay amounts highlight the fluctuating nature of fighter earnings in the UFC. Despite his status as a former champion and fan favorite, Aldo's PGC pay serves as a reminder of the financial realities faced by MMA athletes, even at the pinnacle of the sport. Implications of Aldo's PGC pay The $21,000 PGC pay earned by Jose Aldo sparks discussions about the UFC's compensation model and the broader issue of fighter pay in MMA. While Aldo's earnings may pale in comparison to those of other athletes in more lucrative sports, they underscore the challenges faced by MMA fighters in securing fair compensation for their efforts inside the octagon. Moreover, Aldo's PGC pay serves as a reflection of the evolving landscape of MMA and the UFC's commitment to supporting its athletes. As the sport continues to grow and attract mainstream attention, questions surrounding fighter pay and financial transparency remain paramount. Reactions from fans and experts 
Following the revelation of Jose Aldo's PGC pay at UFC 301, fans and MMA experts alike took to social media to express their thoughts and opinions. While some lamented the relatively modest amount earned by the former champion, others praised Aldo for his contributions to the sport and his unwavering dedication to his craft. Speculation about Aldo's future in the UFC abounds, with many wondering whether he will continue to compete or pursue other ventures outside of MMA. Regardless of what the future holds, Aldo's legacy as one of the greatest fighters in UFC history remains secure. The Legacy of Jose Aldo As the dust settles on UFC 301 and Jose Aldo's potential farewell fight, it's essential to reflect on the legacy he leaves behind. From his early days in the sport to his reign as a UFC champion, Aldo's journey has inspired countless fans and aspiring fighters around the world. Beyond his accomplishments inside the octagon, Aldo's humility, resilience, and sportsmanship set him apart as a true ambassador for the sport of MMA. Whether he chooses to retire or continue competing, Aldo's impact on the UFC and the world of MMA will endure for generations to come. Jose Aldo's $21,000 PGC pay at UFC 301 serves as a poignant reminder of the complexities of fighter compensation in MMA. As one of the sport's most revered figures, Aldo's earnings underscore the challenges faced by fighters in securing fair compensation for their efforts. However, beyond the financial aspect, Aldo's legacy as a UFC legend remains intact, regardless of what the future holds. Thanks for watching NY Sports News. Stay tuned for more updates.